Hey guys, welcome to this chorus lesson, which is for Wolves by Selena Gomez. I'm going to teach you how to play the entire song right here, right now. You can already hear it in the background, so if you want to learn it, just keep on watching. Okay, so this song is quite easy to play. We've just got a couple of chords to learn two parts right here. Let's have a look above the piano. We can find B minor, D, G, and A. And if you don't know what that means, that's absolutely fine. I'm going to teach you all of the notes you have to play anyway. So just sit tight and relax. But if you want to learn some more chords, I've got over 200 chords in my free chords course in the description box down below. So make sure to check that out. For now, though, I want to talk about that left hand. We're going to play octaves. And an octave simply means you play the same note twice. So in this case, you play a B with your pinky and a B with your thumb. Okay. And we're simply going to play the name of the chord. So we have B minor, so play a B octave. Then D, so play a D octave. G, you would normally play a G octave right here. And then for A, play an A octave. But we're going to change that a little bit. Instead of playing the G octave, we're going to play G and D. And instead of playing the A octave, we're going to play A and E. Okay, so we'll play B octave, D octave, and then G and D, and then A and E. Okay, so here. And the way we're going to play it is by going back and forth like this. Okay, so you do that four times per note. So one two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now we're gonna stay on the G and D a little bit longer for two more times. So one, two, and then for three and four, we move to A and E, three, four. Okay, so you could kind of like this. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. Okay, so I hope that's clear. For the right hand, we'll be playing B and D for B minor, D and F sharp for D, then G and D for G, and A and E for A. Okay? And we play this. So again, for the G as well, we, we keep that a little bit longer. So pay attention right here. This is all normal. Now normally you would continue on to A and E, but we're going to stick at G and D. And finish it up with A and E. Okay, so B, D, B, D, D, F sharp, D, F sharp, G, D, G, D, G, D, A, E. Combining it with the left, let's just play the left hand once. that okay so slowly like this now let's play the left hand as I was doing in the beginning but slowly like that okay Let's slow that down a little bit more, and then I'll tell you the second part you need to learn. Okay, so basically what we're going to do right now is we have that intro. Now I want to play the full chords. So B minor is B, D, and F sharp. Then A, D, F sharp for D. We can drop it to G, B, D, and then A, C sharp, E for A. Okay, we're just going to play that twice, okay? Now notice that my left hand has actually changed to octaves right now. You can also do it like this. 
and we're just matching these chords in the right hand with the octave in the left. Then we're gonna get to the chorus where she sings I've been running through the jungle, I've been running with the wolves and we get this. So the chords have changed a little bit. G, A, B minor and A right now. We already know all of the chords, okay? We just changed the order. So left hand is going G octave, A octave, a B octave and an A octave. The right hand now plays G, B, D, A, C sharp, E, B, D, F sharp and A, C sharp, E. I've been running through the jungle. I've been running with the wolves to get to you to get to you. We do that again, down the darkest alleys, saw the dark side of the moon to get to you. And now we switch to D, okay, instead of going back to A. Then we do it again, I've looked for love and every stranger took too much to ease the anger all for you. Yeah, all for you. I've been running through the jungle, I've been crying with the wolves to get to you to get to you and you just hold your B minor chord right here and then we get the drop if you want you can do that by simply playing a G octave and then moving every octave down first and then playing it here okay you can also just play it here but the chords are the same, okay? So G, A, B minor, and then D in this case. We're going, we're going on with the verse, and then we get the pre-chorus again, okay? That's all the same as we've been doing. And then I've been running through the jungle, we get the chorus, and then again we get the drop, and then we're gonna finish up with the chorus, okay? So basically just two parts to know. B minor to D to G, hold for a bit, and then A. And the other one is G, A, B minor, A. And for the drop, it will be G, A, B minor, D. Okay, that's all you have to know in order to play this song. I want to thank you so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. 